He doesn't need a slip. When you can hit the stumps, there's a third duck in a row for Boucher. Not an auspicious tournament for him with the bat. He's showing us a lot of variations. Mujib. Mujib has been absolutely sensational. On the left, the carom ball. I mean, that is a tough enough skill as it is. And on the right-hand side, the googly. Now, what we've said over and over again here is that the New Zealand batsmen aren't picking them. But what is the solution, Grant? How do you go about picking wrist spinners? I do remember having a tour in Sri Lanka, and we were fortunate enough. You can see there in full speed, the carom ball and the googly. We had Saklain Mushta that came on tour with us. And there's the wicket ball, the googly, just going in through the gate wasn't picked by the New Zealand batsman. It's like Klein Mushta came on tour with us and he would take the batters away individually and he could bowl the carom ball. He had a tennis ball with black tape on so we couldn't see the seam. Now when I always looked at a spinner, I would look at the seam and see which way it was spinning in the air and pick it that way. Some batters are different, some off the deck, some from the hand. I didn't feel like I was good enough from the hand. So Cyclean used to take us into the nets with this black tennis ball. So it was taped up and he bowled me six carom balls. First six deliveries. I missed every single one. They so walked down. <laughs> he had to give me a few words. Now we were playing a Jantha Mendes um, during that series. And what he told me was just watch for the finger. That finger comes up. You know it's the carom ball. And Ajanta played the first test and didn't play another test after that. The batters actually got to pick him thanks to Cyclean. And another thing he used to do was you would stand in front of your sticks. He would be almost six to eight meters away. And he would have six to eight balls in his hand. He'd throw you an off spinner, Google, carom ball, off spinner, leg spinner. And you'd have to defend or attack quickly without thinking and almost playing on instinct. And that seemed to, to work pretty well for the New Zealand team. Well, there you go. There's that finger. Just that ring finger that comes up make space for the ball it's that ring finger and the small finger as soon as you see that aerial that's what i like to call it hopefully it is the carom ball <laughs> given yeah! that's the end of the new zealand innings so four wickets for mujib four wickets for case and new zealand can manage only 107 chasing the 310 to win it's the biggest loss in under 19 cricket for New Zealand. 187 was the previous biggest loss against Australia.